I am Becky of PinkSamurai.com and I have another pin mail video for you today. Um, slash a little bit of favorites, not really like a lot of stuff that I got, but um, just some stuff that I came out with. So, yay. Okay, anyway, um, this month is, I promise not every pin mail video is just going to be gushing about Mamobot, but he needs to stop putting out giant groups of amazing pins uh, for that to happen. So, um, first, I think he already had these. They are uh, Mamo Cats, he calls them. Oh, speaking of cats, these cats are being jerks back here, if you heard Sprinkles yelling. Um, look at these babies. I love them. They're perfect. Okay. Back, it's so dark when I go up close. Okay, sorry. Oh, anyway. Um, he came, so Mama Bot came out. <laughs> I'm all over the place today, you guys. I'm like not even going to edit this because I'm a mess. It's fine. Um, okay, so Mama Bot came out with like a whole Ghibli inspired um, line of pins and they are amazing. Like, I've got Kiki and Gigi. <sighs> so good. Let's see, we've got Calcifer. Love this calcifer. I've got two different no faces. This is one of my most favorites. This is one of my favorite new ones of all time. It's so good. Um, we've got a tiny baby Totoro, a cat bus. I mean, come on. I love it. I just love the style. I, I love fatty lines. You know that from my own work. So anytime someone can simplify and cute something that I like and cute it up, I'm all for it. So, okay. And then we've got Haku and a radish spirit, these tiny little babies. Love them. A little Porco Rosso. And I adore this. Look how enormous this pin is. We got a little Ponyo and Sosuke. I love it. I think I'm gonna have to get more. This was restraint, by the way. When I bought all of these, I was, I was really trying to hold back. Okay. Um, there's only one other artist that I got this month um, because clearly. I spend a lot of money on pins. Um, but Adam JK brought these out. Let me take them out of the plastic for you because it's hard to see. Um, oh, this plastic is hard. Okay. So Adam, Adam is one of my favorite artists on Instagram. But he came out with this one and he restocked it and I wanted to be sure to pick it up. But it's the little like verified tick mark that they have on Instagram. And um, it's one of those things that I've totally looked up how to do it. And I really wanted to, and I thought I would feel more legit if I had it. And it doesn't, it doesn't matter. Who cares? It's a tick mark by your name on a social media site. So um, I thought, I thought it was funny. His explanation in it, if you go back and look at his Instagram or the listing for it is really great. Cause he talks about how he really cared about it too for a while. And it's just, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Who cares? And then I really liked this one. Just a little then and now rainbow um, that he has. Because whenever I start to feel down on myself, and this year's had a really slow start for me and my business, but I just have to think about where I was just a couple years ago and where I am now and be grateful for that um, for so many different reasons. And um, I, like, I thought it was a cute little reminder. So there's that. And also, you know, my shameless promotion. I have my Stardust pin that I made with Jordan Denae. Um, she, the original inspiration was, um, cause she does a lot of fandom related stuff. And the original inspiration was from Rogue One, um, the Star Wars story, which I love. But it also, for me, I feel like uh, there's a book that I've never read, apparently, and a movie that I didn't know about until people started commenting on it. But I'm glad people like that and associate it um, with that. But also just in a cosmic sense, you know, like Carl Sagan said, we're made of star stuff and, and all that. So I think it's gorgeous. It's purple and blue and iridescent glitter and crazy. I just think it's so pretty. It's one of my 
I think it's the most beautiful one that that I've come out with um, so far. And her work is so great. This was a a really amazing collaboration. I thought I had a lot of fun with it. So definitely check her out in her shop because I have a bajillion of her shirts too, by the way. And okay, so this month I came out with a little line of stationery and a flipping pen. Okay, look at this pen. Okay, I don't know if you can see, where is it? It's a fat floaty cat going for a cookie and there's glitter in there. Okay, so you think fatty, pen, pink, glitter, cookie, cat, can't get any better, right? Boom, it lights up! Ah! I love it. It's incredible, it's ridiculous. It's one of those like dream products that you wanna design and come out with. <laughs> it just makes me really happy, it's just insane. Also, uh, notepads, which is also fun and exciting and they match the pen, but the pen is really the star of the show. Like, come on, so. <laughs> Definitely check out my shop if you want to get a ridiculous one. Um, I have to say, in working with dream projects and uh, crazy things, the uh, minimum order quantity is a lot. So I have plenty for everyone. So please, please order. <laughs> but yeah, just to show you again. Da -da -da. Rawr. Yeah. So good. Okay, yeah. So that was pins and shameless promotion for April. I remembered it this month. I know what month it is, right? It is. I had to check my watch. It's fine. So Turks and I bid you adieu and I will have another, uh, hopefully more varied <laughs> favorites video for you next month. All right. Bye.